Do you want these titles in your video? Let's start. Make sure you've installed the fonts provided in the download link in the description below. Open Premiere Pro and head over to the Captions and Graphics workspace. In the Essential Graphics tab, press the plus icon next to Local Templates to import the presets. Select each folder to import them. Once done, press the down arrow. Now, you have a variety of new text presets. In this case, we choose Urban Titles, drag it onto your timeline, and there's your title. To customize, select it, and head to Edit, and here you can tweak text, color, font, size. Experiment with different presets to make your videos stand out. That's it for this tutorial. Let me show you how to make a typewriter effect. First change your workspace to Captions and Graphics. Now add a text by pressing T or by selecting the Type tool. To align the text press Align Center horizontally and Align Center vertically, you can change the distance between the letters by moving this. Change it to your liking. If you did this, realign the text. Now go to Effects and type in Crop. Drag the Crop effect to your text. Go to Effects Control. Go to Crop and make a keyframe on right. Move the keyframe to the right and make another keyframe before the zero keyframe. And change this to 100. Now you have your typing effect. Change the distance of your keyframes to change the speed to your liking. You can also add a sound effect. And boom you have your typewriter effect. First go to Captions and Graphics. Now add a text by pressing T or selecting the text tool. Now type your text. Change the font to you liking. Now align the text to the middle. Now we make a shake layer. Drag it around the text. Select the mask and shape box. This is new in Premiere 2023. Now go to the effect control and select the text. Scroll down to transform and make a keyframe by clicking the stopwatch. Drag the keyframe to the right and change the position of the text so it is out of the shape layer. Now you have your text reveal. Change the speed to your liking and add an ease into the keyframes to make it look smoother. Start by creating your text on the timeline. Type out your message, head over to Caption and Graphics Workspace, choose your font, and make it stand out. Now, let's make it glow. Duplicate your text layer. Hold Option or Alt and drag up. Select the bottom text layer. Head over to the Effects panel and find Gaussian Blur. Drag that effect onto your duplicated text layer. Adjust the blur settings until you achieve that dreamy, glowing look. You can also keyframe the blur to get an animated glow. First change your workspace to Captions and Graphics. Now add a text by pressing T or by selecting the Type tool. Change the font to your liking. We use the Impact font. Scale the font to your liking. Make sure it is big enough. To align the text press Align Center horizontally and Align Center vertically, go to Effects and Search, Track Matte Key. Drag the effect to your clip. Go to your effects controls and change the matte to Video 2. And boom you have your video in your text.